straight to Elliott. Got in there quick and got it long. And there's a free kick. Everyone's looking to see which way it's going. It's going Collingwood's way. And Brody, is it going to Roscoe? <laughs> Everyone knows. No, no one quite knows how to do that. But it, it is going to be oh, Trey Roscoe. Yeah. It was for tunnelling. He was pushed under the ball. I think it was the decision. Oh, it's not a lot. Robbie it. Fox just lent on him. So pick 55 in last year's AFL draft. East Fremantle Junior. Close to getting pinged. Oh, Noble got knocked over as he kicked it. And Alvin comes out with great aggression and takes the mark on the move. Straight for the game. There's the score as it stands. It's a 14-point margin. And how different it'll be and it'll feel if he can kick straight here. Jamie Elliott, who hasn't had the kicking boot on this year, but he has now and it counts for the pies. And given their kicking woes so far, that will feel pretty good. Malikin is in the thick of things in this quarter so far. His hand pass, it was good progression to Dawson, but comes unstuck with Johnny Noble. Oh, and might be 50. And it's such a low scoring game to go, but back in the team. Normally a good ball user. <laughs> and this for his first goal in AFL footy. Other teams, other players tonight have missed, but he hits the target. Well, it was a gift, wasn't it, really? Again. Back to the square. And a free kick to the pies. This is 2013. An extremely unlucky, but his perseverance has seen him stay in this kind of team. And he delivers the goal, the go ahead goal. There is no room to manoeuvre. Dacos found a way out with side bottom. It's in good hands. It was in great hands. And he finds Adams. Goals. Could be the difference between winning and losing. And this one earlier, but he has been very accurate this year, Taylor Adams. Up to 83% until tonight. And that trend continues as Collingwood extends its lead. Oh, a rush kick in. Kick in. Dacos keeps it in. Like his old man. Fox comes over, but he just handballs it in, keeps it in, and that conversion is exceptional. And great anticipation from Dacos to come forward. If he doesn't come forward, Beals potentially gets the ball over the top and gets a possession, but just the ability to come forward and that finish, unbelievable.